Hi guys, it's Greg in here and today we're gonna test the Norma IPA80 versus IPA140 and I've got a sound sample for you and I'll share with you my experience about those two amplifiers right after the samples, the sound samples that I recorded here. But first I'd like to say two things. So in my last video where I compared the Fossi ZA3 to Norma IPA140, I did a mistake and yeah, I connect the ZA3 wrong in a wrong phase, so the sound didn't sound that as good as it should. So my apologies to you guys and to Fossi for sure. So yeah, I was in hurry and you know, YouTube algorithm is like, it likes having videos every week, every other week, you know, like regularly. And yeah, I had like crazy time. Uh, in here and as you can see for some time there were like no videos that's because uh, yeah my wife gave birth to our second son like a week ago so it's extremely crazy and for some time I'll put on uh, some videos that I pre-recorded in Cory's in my local Hafi store so I hope you'll enjoy that guys and finally I have some more time now and I'll put them on YouTube. I try to be regular and my normal videos will come probably in like a month or so. So once again, my apologies to you guys and yeah, enjoy the comparison in between the Norma IPA140 and 180 and they labeled as Amp A and Amp B in the sound samples. And after the sound samples, I'll share with you my findings about those two amplifiers. So without further ado, just put on your headphones and enjoy. I don't know where she came from. Kinda turned me upside down. I just don't know what to do. I wanna spend the night at hers and bring her one of my t-shirts so it smells like her perfume. Now I really get what the love songs are talking about And I just want to tell her how I feel, scream it out loud Have you ever been in love? Have you ever lost your head? Have you felt like you were out of breath when you saw her in that dress? When your heart is beating fast and you're sweating And you can't stop looking at her smile Then you've been in love that's how you know you've been in love There's something about the way she laughs And the way she always dances When she thinks nobody sees And when she's gonna miss her soul I tell her, baby, please don't go I think you should stay with me And I, I really get what the love songs are talking about Oh, and I just want to tell her how I feel, scream it out loud. Have you ever been in love? Have you ever lost your head?
I woke up in the middle of the night mm -hmm. And I wondered how you're always right It gets me I couldn't see what you saw in me But you showed me how to believe Still gets me When I look back I can see you're hiding Waiting for a moment to step in And I'll never understand how you saw it Took from 
So what did you hear? Did you manage to hear the differences? Because for me, like the IPA 80 is more analog, but less dynamic, less open and less airy. And the sound stage is a little bit collapsed in comparison to the IPA 140. Of course, it has like less power, but if you really like the analoginess in the sound, and you don't need that much power. It's very colorful, immersive and nice sounding amplifier. However, for me, I like to balance out the dynamics, punchiness and analoginess. So for sure, the IPA 140 would be and will be a better choice. And apparently, I believe the Polish distributor of Norma and Corys already arranged for the power amp and preamp from Norma to arrive and they're waiting for me for the test but yeah I'll probably do that in like two weeks time and for sure I'll record it. So I'm looking forward to your comment in which amp did you like more and see you in my next video. Bye!